Hey everyone, it's Gary the Google Guy again. I thought I'd let you know about a brand new update that Google has added to Google Drive slash Google Docs. Now, it can be difficult, not to mention time consuming, to navigate lengthy, complex documents. To make that process just a little bit easier, Google has launched an outline tool in Google Docs on the web and for Android. Displayed in a pane to the left of the page, the outline features headers for each section of your document, making it simple and easy to jump to section to section. If you haven't manually applied headers, no worries, they'll do it for you, intelligently detecting the logical divisions within your work. You can then edit or remove these headers as necessary. So to show you, one of the things that I've got is just a simple lesson plan here. And this is just one of the templates that Google offers in Google Docs. Now to locate this new tool, go to the Tools menu up at the top, and you'll see it says Document Outline. If I click on that, you'll notice that to the left of the page, a panel pops out. And then each division that I have here is shown to the left underneath the title, which is Name of this Lesson. Now you'll see here I have Overview and Purpose. Click on that and it will go to that area with my cursor. I can go to verification and just kind of like a table of contents it will take you right to that area. Now obviously this one already has those divisions of my work already there. Now let's go to another document up at the top here. I have nothing here in terms of headers. I can go to that same document outline tool, opens that panel to the left and this time you'll notice that there are no headings here. Well, that's really easy to fix. What I can do is I can go up to the top, select some text, go to my pull down, and tell Google that this is my title. And it will add that there. I can then go to each of the areas that I'd like to pull out as a body, select, and I can do a couple of different things. I can just bold it, and you'll see it will add that here. I can also go to my headings and create this as a heading and it will add it there. I can even go to a certain area, select my text, and use the underline, and it will add that as a subset underneath that area. Or change it on the fly, and it will add it, just like that. Thanks everyone, and I hope you find this document outline tool useful in your everyday use of Google Docs.